Hey guys, what's up? So, uh, I'm actually driving right now. Uh, this is super last minute. I just got a phone call from uh, Southcom saying that my new iPhone is here. I was actually on the waiting list. So yeah, I just received the call and now I'm actually on the way picking it up. So let's go. So I'm at Paradigm right now, but before we go to the store, we've got to get the money. All right guys, just got back from uh, Paradigm Mall. I am ready to unbox the phone with you guys right now. So first and foremost, you guys uh, mesti tanya uh, like kenapa I beli the phone at a Cellcom Blue Cube Center instead of buying the phone uh, at a switch ataupun machine. So that is a reason kenapa I beli from Cellcom and I will answer that question uh, later on. But yeah, let's get into the unboxing first. So first off, here is the bag yang I dapat. It's a Cellcom paper bag, nothing special. Moving on to the main attraction of this video is boom the all new iphone 13 pro max 256 gig this is the box so as you guys nampak here the box memang ni best gila eh and as you guys see kan ni tak ada plastik kan memang masa i uh, beli tadi pun there isn't any plastic anymore uh, because apple is moving towards a more eco-friendly movement so yeah memang tak ada plastic only thing is dia ada macam these two stickers on top here and on the bottom here but diorang dah buka dah because diorang nak test the phone uh, make sure it, dia boleh on sebelum i beli the phone opening up the box and here it is Tada! here is the new iphone the new iPhone 13 Pro Max uh, in the Sierra Blue colorway. Super, super nice. Before I talk more about the phone, let's see what's in the box. So first off, we have the Type-C to Lightning adapter cable for charging, fast charging, and also some manuals and whatnot and sticker. And that's it. Brick untuk charging pun memang tak dapat. Uh, luckily for me, I have the brick because I used the iPhone 11 Pro previously, so brick to I still ada. And yeah, thank God for that. So moving on to the iPhone. Uh, in this video, I am not gonna uh, make a, like a super detailed tech review. If you guys nothing on, on more tech specs about this phone, you guys really check out um, various other YouTubers yang specialize on tech review. But I am here to uh, simplify the review uh, to the things yang most generally orang nak tahu lah about this new iPhone. There are two new uh, big things about this new iPhone. First off is the new camera. The camera is actually bigger. So yeah, we're gonna test that out. And the second thing that I am most excited to try is the new 120 hertz uh, refresh rate on the new iPhone 13 Pro. They say that the refresh rate is uh, life changing, so I'm gonna test it out. Yeah, let's get into it. All right guys, first off, I will be doing the comparison of the uh, refresh rate on the iPhone uh, 13 Pro Max compared to the iPhone 12 Pro Max. So let's have a look at the difference. So yeah, as you guys can see on this phone, this is scrolling through a page. Okay, on the iPhone 13 Pro Max. And now I am scrolling on the iPhone 12 Pro Max. I don't know if you guys can see any difference on it, but yeah, uh, to me personally, holding the phones on my hand, I believe I still there is quite a difference on the iPhone 13 Pro memang. It feels slightly quicker lah on 120 FPS. Yeah, it feels slightly smoother and yeah. All right guys, now I'll be showing you guys the camera quality on the new iPhone 13 Pro Max. And yeah, let's move on to the camera. All right guys, so this is the front face camera of the iPhone 13 Pro. And yeah, this is how it looks like. All right guys, so uh, this is the back camera of the iPhone 13 Pro. So this is how it looks like. It's on 4K 60 uh, frame per second. So yeah, boom, boom, boom. So yeah, this is my setup. This is where I did my videos on my PlayStation 5 and whatnot, my lighting and yeah, so here's the camera. And I will also be showing you guys the new cinematic mode on the new iPhone 13 Pro. Okay guys, so coming back to kenapa I beli the phone at Cellcom and not 
at any machines or Apple reseller stores. Why? It's because me personally, I am a long time user of Cellcom. So buying a phone lump sum through Cellcom saves me a lot of money. And that's why, as you guys can see on the title and also on the thumbnail, Imang, I bought this phone under retail because retail was 5,799. But for me personally, I paid only 4,558 and this is how it works. If you are a user of Cellcom MPAS, like me personally, I'm using the MPAS RM98 Ringgit. So if I buy a phone lump sum through Cellcom, it will cut off uh, some amount. But shout out there, I must be a user of Cellcom for at least two years to get this uh, discount for lump sum uh, purchase of iPhone. So for me, I have no uh, contracts, no strings attached to it. Just get the phone for that cheap price. If I'm not mistaken, bukan Cellcom saja yang buat this kind of promotion. Uh, mostly other places pun ada juga buat, but I'm not very sure about that. You guys need to check up on your guys punya telco. Alright guys, I think that will be it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Till the next video, peace. Baby, it's time for me to find somebody else